Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Eight, yeah. seven, oh, six, wow. five, four, three, two, one. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> oh, wow. Awaiting visual confirmation. All right. Let's see. We got it? Waiting. Waiting. And we have and impact. We <laughs> for humanity in the name of planetary defense. So the team knew they were ready, but there's nothing like seeing it for the first time and then seeing images like that that just don't disappoint where you really can see this, this asteroid that humanity has never seen before. And I think what's so exciting is we got to do that all together. The test went spectacularly. It was really everything that we expected and even honestly more. We were sitting there watching these images come in as we got closer and closer to Dimorphos, saw those surface features and they came into focus. I think all of us had said it would be spectacular and it was. You know, you always have maybe have a little nerves, but people really have worked on this for years, tested so many different simulations. The team took over 200,000 images up to this moment in those 10 months of cruise to calibrate every little which way that spacecraft moves itself. It's like we knew everything about it. What we're going to be seeing probably in the next couple of months, we're actually going to get a confirmation of exact uh, period change that we made. And then over the next two months, we're going to see more information from the investigation team on what period change did we actually make. Because that's our number two goal. Number one was hit the asteroid, which we've done. But now number two is really measure that period change and characterize how much ejecta uh, we actually put out. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Eight, yeah. Seven, oh, six, wow. five, four, three, two, one. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh wow. Awaiting visual confirmation. All right. Let's see. We got it? Waiting. Waiting. And we have and impact. We <laughs> for humanity in the name of planetary defense.